Hey folks, it's me again. Uh, right now, I'm in the final final stages of the demon spawn, getting my paint on, so to speak. So basically, uh, right now, I am matching up the shades and tonalities in the mask here to the spine. I've already went ahead and put in uh, some beiges, some whites, a little bit of flesh tone. So right now I have um, thinned out my beige, really, really thin, and I'm misting over the entire piece. And by doing that, it's going to bring a lot of color. It's going to make some colors more subtle, and make other ones pop as well in this. Once I get done with this stage, I'm going to break out the brown and do all my shadowing with the brown. It really makes stuff pop out even more. Break up some areas, make it easier to read on camera. And if you guys are wondering how I got these great cracks and texture um, in this, I used um, what's called an undercoat. Which is this right here. It's really good by, um, it's used for cars. It's a rubberized spray. And I sprayed over the entire spine with it. And um, the reason why I did that instead of my normal latex is that um, the director wants to be able to shoot this in some harsh conditions like out there in the rain, you know dank, dirty, muddy areas, so I have to make sure that this holds up to all that abuse. So, I went ahead and coated the, the entire thing with it. Um, if you guys do choose to use that spray, make sure that you um, wear a mask. Stuff is not good for the lungs at all. So wear your mask, um, and it takes 24 hours to cure fully. So like the first layer, I went ahead and let it cure fully. When I went ahead and put the second layer of undercoat on this, I waited about about six hours, and then I went ahead and I dusted the entire thing with the eggshell white and left it outside the cold weather, well, in here or Oregon for cool, cool weather. Um, and what happened was by doing that, it forced all these cracks all throughout which is great it just gives it much more detail it makes it look a bit more ancient a bit more gnarly you know and the client loves the effect he gave it all right so next time you guys see this piece it will be done so till then peace